Hey everyone and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. On this video we're checking out the Mercenaries Additional Orders and we're going to be getting a triple S rank on the Bloody Village stage. So to get to the Mercenaries Additional Orders we go to our bonuses right there. You can see the original Mercenaries levels here with our triple S rating. Here is a new stage, the Bloody Village. And that's the one we're gonna do. So, we get two characters. We can either be Ethan Winters or Chris Redfield. Chris is new. We definitely wanna try him out. Alrighty, uh, so let's get a recap on how this all works. I don't remember what information is old and what information is new, so we'll just go over all of it. How to play the mercenaries. First, purchase any equipment or weapons you need from the shop. Then, when you go out into the field, you need to defeat as many enemies as possible within the time limit. Get a good rhythm going and build up combos for extra points. Once you've defeated a certain number of enemies, the goal will appear. Touch the goal to finish and to move on to the next area. Complete more areas to rack up even more points for each stage. You can also touch the yellow orbs for bonus time and keep the party going. Speaking of orbs, there are also blue orbs which give you special abilities. Each one has three random abilities to choose from. Check out all the cool moves that match your fighting style. You keep abilities between areas and there's no limit to how many you can have either. Also, if you equip the same ability multiple times, it will become even more effective. So keep an eye out for all those orbs. Any money or time left over when you reach the goal will be counted towards your final score, along with enemies defeated in combos. Your final score determines your rank. The higher your rank at the end of the stage, the better the prize you'll get. May the odds be in your favor. Alright, so then we have a description of Ethan. Ethan Winters. Ethan is the base character with a wide arsenal available to him. Handguns, not very powerful, but fast rate of fire. Shotguns, powerful at close range. Sniper rifles, difficult to use, but can pierce anything. He's a versatile character, making it easy to try out different fighting styles. Select the best guns for each stage and chain those combos. Handguns, small handheld guns which are easy to use. Not very powerful, but possess a high rate of fire. Can be made more powerful with focused upgrades to take down tougher foes. Bullets are plentiful, so you'll rarely run out of ammo. Shotguns, scattershot guns that are great for inexperienced shooters. Can blast weak enemies away with a single shot, making them great for stacking combos. Widespread of pellets, so enemies are easier to hit. Not well suited to long distance engagements. Slow reload speeds and low ammo capacity. Reload tactically and don't get overrun. And sniper rifles. Devastating long distance rifles which are great for experienced shooters. The piercing bullets can take out multiple well aligned enemies at a time. Difficult to hold steady so careful aiming is needed. Reload tactically and don't get overrun. Alright then we have Chris Redfield. Chris is a combat specialist who fights with his guns and fists. Guns are great for long distance attacks, but getting close to punch some bad guys and Chris will get fired up, increasing his onslaught gauge. Once the onslaught gauge is full, Chris can activate onslaught, which greatly increases his speed and attack. Be careful, Chris can't block to reduce damage or recover his health with items. So take advantage of his brute strength and eliminate your enemies before they get the better of you. He has straight punch, R1 to perform a straight punch, a powerful far reaching punch, the onslaught gauge increases greatly when an enemy is killed with a straight punch. Then he has left hook, L1 to perform a left hook. A tight, fast punch, won't be interrupted by enemy attacks, can frighten enemies and stagger them. Then he has stomp, R2, when the enemy is on the ground, to perform a stomp. Most enemies can be finished off with a single stomp. And onslaught, when the onslaught gauge is full, hold L1 plus R1 to unleash onslaught. Gain the following effects while Onslaught is active. Speed greatly increases. Attack greatly increases for both punches and guns. Reload speed and rate of fire greatly increases. Once Onslaught is activated, the Onslaught gauge decreases over time. Onslaught will end when the gauge becomes empty. Take out enemies while Onslaught is active to extend its duration. Alright. And what's this over here? Mercenary ranks the Bloody Village. Oh, right. I forgot. It tells you the score that you need. Triple S is a mystery. Alright, let's grab that free stuff. And let's talk to Seeking the something in particular. So I'm going to be using my handgun a lot. So we'll this give that some power upgrades. Done in just a moment. Get that up to level 4. Maybe we'll 
increase its ammo capacity. Leave this to me. Right, that should be good. And then I also want to give my assault rifle an upgrade. I don't want to upgrade my, my gloves. I don't find the punching to be particularly useful. I'll show you guys Onslaught and a few punches, but I'm not really going to be using it. All right. Uh, we hey, could get some supplies if we want. There's some Onslaught stuff. Oh, actually, energized guns. I actually didn't see that before. I should have gotten this. We'll get this... Uh, We'll get this at some point, because that's good. The onslaught gauge increases slightly when an enemy is killed with a gun. That would be very helpful. He also has the target locator. A laser targeting device used to track targets. Targeting must be held until shells drop. That could be really good, but it's unnecessary. So I didn't test it. Uh, and then you could like sell stuff if you wanted for more money. But we should be good to go. Next we meet. Let's go. Start. Start. Right, took them out. I want to go over here and get this purple orb. Hopefully, I get a good ability. Agile, fickle shooter. Attack increases when switching between enemies. Eh, may as well get all the damage ones. Let's get fickle shooter. Let's show you a punch. Straight punch. Alright, straight up killed him. Oh wait, no, I didn't. Wait, did he get out of Alright, there we go. Remember, important to keep your combo going. Stomp this guy. Boom! Insta insta kill. Let's punch him. Give him some left hooks. Hey, you like that left hook, huh? Straight punch. Oh actually one like Ah! Uh oh, I need to kill. There we go. Alright, we gotta stop screwing around and make some progress here. There we go. Alright, we can get some time over here. Boom. I need another kill. Uh oh, I need a kill. There we go. Stop! Stop! Good, this is filling my onslaught gauge. Ability. Hmm. Maybe corpse combustor. Enemies will likely explode when defeated with a gun. Let's do that. Got those freebies. Probably should have just stomped him. Silly. Don't know why I did that. Alright, moving on. Grab whatever good as we can. Don't have to grab everything. Let's stomp him. Ooh, yeah. Stomp him as well. Let's get the time. Turn around and hit that. Alright, then switch to the assault rifle. Reload! Back to the pistol. Shoot him in the foot. Love to shoot him on the button, but couldn't get that to work. Go. Oh, explosion got him. Nice. Come on, explosions. Oh, I need you, explosions. There it is. Thank you. All right, and we full comboed the level, and we're in. Clear. Good start. All right, grab our freebies. Ah, yes, yes. I think I picked up some things to sell. Let me look. 
Yeah, I got a large crystal. May as well sell that. I might sell the hand grenades, but man, eh, we'll hold on to it. Why not? All right, your coin. Sell that. Choose wise. Oh, and I. Your life may depend. I on think it. I want the energized guns. We'll pick that up, and then we'll get another Delighted. power upgrade for the handgun and the assault rifle. We'll do power there as well. Alright. And you can see our assault. A good deal, if I say so myself. Our uh, onslaught gauge is uh, almost full, so I can use that ability soon. Alright. Oh, and let's make sure everything's reloaded. There we go. Alright. Let's go. Start. Got that. Onslaught gauge is full. Seems kind of silly to use it at the moment, though, with regular enemies. We got this real quick. Uh, out of reach is always a good one to get. Long distance attacks do more damage. And we're going to turn on onslaught mode. Here we go. My attack speed just went through the roof. A single corpse explosion. Alright, we're going with the assault rifle. Got him. Probably should have done onslaught for these guys, but oh well. It's fine. Let's get a kill before we drop our combo. Now we got five kills left. Load and then tear this guy apart. Kept that combo going. Let's grab this. Ooh, break shot's a really good one. I like break shot a lot. Initial attack does more damage when the enemy's HP is full. And fighter's also good, but break shot is where it's at. Let's get that. Very good with the uh, handgun. All right, and we comboed the whole level. Oh, there might be another purple. Yep, another purple orb. Let's pick this up. Uh, duration of onslaught increases or pistol master. Oh, I'm doing pistol master. All right, we gotta end this level. Okay, there's our freebies. Shall I choose something for you? Did I get anything to sell? I did. Your coin. Sell that. Could sell ammo if we wanted to. We have a ton of handgun ammo, for example. But uh, no need. It'll be fine. Choose wisely. Let's Your get our final handgun upgrade. We'll get our final what? assault rifle upgrade. Oh, it's fine. All finished. And that should do it. Good day then. All right, let's go. Start. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice job exploding on them. Perfect. Let's go get this purple orb. Hmm, we'll get in fighter. Close combat attacks do more damage. Why not? 
might help. Might not. It probably won't hurt. Alright, let's bring out a hand grenade. Throw that over there. We'll throw another one, why not? Alright, and then switch to assault rifle with that kill. We'll just keep the assault rifle out the rest of the time, I think. Although, I don't know, I got so many upgrades for the handgun, maybe... Maybe I shouldn't. Eh, whatever, let's we'll keep it up. Keep him low health. Let's get this purple orb. I believe this is our last one. Ooh. Out of reach, all brawn or no brainer. Those are all nice. Uh, we'll do all brawn though. I don't really have to move around anymore, so. May as well get a damage increase. I am going slow though. Let's go over here. There's a pig. We got a big boy. Let's throw a flash at him. Let's turn on Onslaught. Destroyed him. Who's left? One enemy, boom! Alright. And we are out. Triple S rank. We also got the trophy Village of Blood for completing the Bloody Village in additional orders. Achieved A rank in the Bloody Village. Unlocked stage, the Bloody River. Achieved S rank for one stage with Chris. Unlocked ability, Auto Onslaught. All right. So there we go. We got our triple S rank. And that is gonna do it for this video. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time.